you know that that's why too, bro. I would think that in our community, we will really be looking towards uh, um, entrepreneurship and being entrepreneurs. You know why? Yeah. Because yeah, sometimes going to get that job on the corner or that job at that grocery store may not even be comparable to that GI check. So you're like, why am I going to go take that job over there when my GI check is the same or a little bigger? So that's why you take advantage of becoming an entrepreneur. You know, uh, this is what I say. I'll I'll be like, you got 12 months in a year. Average income in the U.S. is, and I'm talking about everybody, not men, women. Everybody in the U.S. is 31,000, right? I say you got 12 months in a year, right? Let's say you're getting that GI check. For 11 of the months, <clears throat> you could be just focusing on starting a new, you know, business or something like that. You know, you got, let's say you got 11 months, you know, you want to make sure that you can at least make the average or more, right? Because that's the average. You don't want to make no less than that. You got 11 months. You cannot make nothing in 11 months focusing on that business. And in a 12th month, make 32000 In one month, just from focusing on entrepreneurship, you didn't make what you didn't make more than what the average is in the U.S., you know, it's it's people. I want people to think to understand. It's not, it's it's not impossible to become an entrepreneur. They don't. Uh, uh, we talked about it before. When you were starting to become an entrepreneur, starting your businesses, you was broke. You had to start off broke. You probably went months with no money, not making nothing. I went over a year, not making a dollar. But when you start to make that money, you start to see it. Calculate. You start to see what it turned into. So you. So people, you got you got to take those risks. You know, you got to take those chances to go out there and become an entrepreneur. But once you do it and once you see it work, you'll see it's worth it. Yeah. You know, going to work that job, you're going to be making average. Right. You're going to be probably making it, which, which if that's what you're making, it's okay. Because at least you're doing something. You ain't sitting on your ass, right? Yeah. But I'm just saying, I want to see more of us become entrepreneurs. And you could do it. And I'm and, 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 and what you see the average is, it don't got to be like that if you go out there and focus on that. And just listen to when it come down to the tools that you need to go out there and make that happen. Yeah. You know, that's why we want to talk about it more. We want to give people the tools. Yeah. Yeah. Let people know and understand how you could do it. Yeah. Let people know our stories, yeah. how we was able to make it happen. Yeah. Look, we started off in cars and on the streets yeah. without a dollar. You yeah. said you learned a lot of stuff. You know, when you came out, you, you was around Nip them and you all hustlers. Oh, it's cool. like, okay, let me put, let me put my parts, you know, put my yeah. pieces to the table and do what I got to do. Yeah. And then now look at you got you know, you're on shop, you're in Vegas doing your thing and everything like that. Yeah. You know, same with me. I'm in my car, you know, got, you know, I I, I got, you know, uh, 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 evicted in a place that I was in. You know what I'm saying? I sat up in there, you know, to the last day when a cop came <laughs> and they said, you got to go, brother. But, you know, everything packed up. Yes, yeah, in my car. When in my car, I was in my car for about seven months. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, shit, I, I ain't going to let this stop me from trying to start this business, though. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people just give up, go move with a family member, and then just get a job. Yeah, yeah. Say, nah, I'm gonna live in my. I said, nah, I'm gonna live in my car. I got no. I I looked at it as I got nowhere else to go. Yeah, yeah, this is yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Cause to me, to me, the way I looked at it, going over there and living with a family member is hell. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's my hell. Yeah, 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 yeah. So this is all. You know, make it or die trying. Yeah, yeah. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. So that's what I'm saying. If you just and a lot of people not even in that position, you may have a little bit of balance where you may be living with a family member or somebody and, 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 and they saying, hey, just get a little job or show that you're doing something. Right. Use that time to go and try to start something. Yeah. Whatever it is that you love, you loved when it come down to pressing up the shirts and all of that, yeah. that you loved it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know, uh, 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 um, doing it with your team and all of that yeah. and turning it to something big, you know? Yeah. You know, I, I loved helping people get jobs and, and, and you know, uh, uh, putting opportunities out there for others, you know, when it come down to the medical field or the trucking, you know, company. I always say my skill is business. Yeah. You know, some people's skill, they may have went and got a degree. Some people's skill may be, you know, sports players is, is sports, basketball, football, baseball. Yeah. My skill is business, entrepreneurship. But when it come down to our community, I want to see more of us doing it because that's where we losing it yeah. when it come down to entrepreneurs, up and coming entrepreneurs and everything like that. Yeah. Well, you got to set goals like, you know, as a hustler, you know, our, my goal is make 100 a day. You know what I mean? No matter what, I had to make 100. You yeah. know what I mean? So that was 3000 a month. You know what I mean? So if you start breaking it down, you're talking about what? It's like, what, 36000 a year. You yeah. know what I mean? So that was just a uh, 100 a day. You know what I mean? So uh, I remember days I couldn't make 100. Then it was days, man, I'm just making uh, five, 600 a day. You know, then it was $1,000 days, $1,000 days. 
So uh, yeah. if you set a goal at 100 a day, like me personally, it's, it's multiple hustles where you can get 100 a day, like little little odd jobs, you can get $100 a day, you know what I mean? I mean, you could, you could theoretically stand in the gas station and, and, and do windows and get 100 a day, you yeah. know what I mean? So it's uh, many opportunities to get 100 a day, and if you're waiting on a GR check or you're waiting on a, a SSI or something and it's, and it's paying 200 or 800 or 1,000, a uh, hundred a day is more than that thousand that you waiting on. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's a it's fact. Get off your ass, get off the couch, and uh, and go get it. You know, go get at least a hundred a day. You know yeah. what I mean? Uh, uh, and even to this day, that's always been my goal. So I wake up to and uh, make a couple hundred. Uh, uh, wait on that first sale. Now the sales are different. I might get two or three hundred as soon as I get up. You know what I mean? Uh, so yeah, just set that goal. You know what I mean? A uh, hundred a day. Wake up and say, you know what? I'm gonna get up early. I'm gonna get out and about. And uh, I'm gonna see if somebody needs some help. You know, a little twenty dollars. I'll help you clean this up. Oh man, your car broke down. You need some help with that, man. Forty here, thirty there. You know, uh, uh, be willing to humble yourself and just make that hundred a day. Yeah, yeah. You know, before you know, it's gonna be them days like now. I made five hundred. Ain't even lunchtime. You know what I mean? Yeah. And, uh, and just keep that hustle mentality. Uh, so I took the hustle mentality. You know, uh, uh, the crack cocaine seller to selling cars is this different product. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. So you can go from selling being the ultimate drug dealer to now, you know what? I'm going to sell something, different product, you know, and I don't have to look over my shoulder, you know what I mean? So that's the difference of being an entrepreneur. You know, you could take your same skill set, whatever you're good at, you know, whatever it is that you've been twisting or whatever it is you've been doing, looking over your shoulder, do something else, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Uh, yeah, I would advise people to be entrepreneurs. It's, it's nothing like it, you know, waking up and it's nothing like the feeling of when you closing your shop at night and, uh, and you had a good day. You know what I mean? Uh, customers smiling when they leave them with their clothes and shit. Uh, yeah. Then you got the asshole customers that's bitching over one shirt. You know what I mean? You got motherfuckers get 200 shirts and they ain't complain one time. And, you know, so yeah. it's, it, it, you know, business. It, you know, uh, I'm going through legal processes and shit with landlords, you know, after I done fixed up all their properties and shit. And, you know, uh, yeah. you know, so I'm going through legal battles and shit. Uh, um, and uh, that's a part of business, though. You know yeah, what I mean. Yeah. Uh, be careful with these contracts you sign. You know, uh, look into the, your rights to rescind your contracts. Uh, 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 look at all the um, look at look at these contracts and, and and do your research. We got Google. We got YouTube now. It's, there's no reason in the world for you to be stupid. Uh, yeah. Anytime a problem arise, like you know, uh, some paperwork came in the mail, and I had to do some court issues, so. Uh, got right to Google, study for two or three days. So when I got to the courthouse and it came time to file these papers, I was already familiar. Mm. You know what I mean? Downloaded the documents I needed. Uh, uh, <clears throat> there's no reason not to do what you need to do. Uh, time is moving so fast. Yeah. You, know? you notice you wake up, it, it, time is moving fast. Mm -hmm. So you only can do a brick a day. You only can do a little something a day. So if you got time to hustle, make your hundred a day put in an hour or two on your craft and like something, your God-given talent. Yeah. You know what I mean? A lot of people waste nine, 10 hours a day uh, at Walmart, you know, just to make minimum wage or whatever it may be, but yeah. them nine, 10 hours could have been toward a craft or mm -hmm. toward something, uh, a trade, you know, something that's gonna last you a longevity. Walmart shut down, you out of a job, and you back to square one. Yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? And don't so, got no real skill. Exactly, no you real know? skill. So if it's something you like to do, uh, I'm always good with my hands. So I like to do shit with my hands. So uh, whatever you're good at, figure out what it is. You yeah. know, uh, uh, everybody not gonna be the next rapper, the next basketball player. So what's that plan B? What's that plan C? Yeah. You know what I mean? And then no matter what, stick to that at least 100 a day. If your bills is more than 3,000 a month, you gotta make more than 100 a day. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? It, uh, you might need 200 a day, 6,000 a month, 300 a day, 9,000 a month. You know what I mean? That's not that's not a lot of money. That's not an unimaginable number. You know, yeah, to make yeah. 300 a day, you know what I mean? So uh, set a goal at 100, and then if you make three or four a day, uh, start saving. Yeah, that's okay. a fact. That's a fact. I step in the ring, my eye on the mission. At a level of so this right here was my vision. Make it to the top, catch everyone's attention. The haters they can hate as long as they listen to the words that I say as my tongue keeps twisting. Heavyweight flow, you not in my division.